got this. Welcome to Road of the Show 157, Kleshka Crew. We continue our series here against the Tampa Bay Rays, and we hope to stay in our winning ways. I'm talking to Lane Thomas. Yeah, he's here on the team. Don't know when he got here. Javi, would you be able to answer the question? Is that why you just came online? Look at this guy's name. John Dacaxis kid? I, I don't even know. I'm not even going to try. Two to zero already. We're facing Tyler Glass now. And I hate when it's daytime here. And I rolled over immediately. That is going to be out. Damn. Okay, it's hard to see at the beginning of Angel Games because that sky blends in so well with that ball and especially with a taller pitcher like Tyler Glass now, it's going to be harder to pick up. It still is. My God. The sky is, you know, it's getting in the golden hour right now, but that was still hard to see. I didn't pick it up till the last second. Come on. And, oh, I had. Dude, I literally saw that when it crossed the chalk in the other batter's box. It's tough. That sky, I don't know. And this is, see, look how late I am. Very late. That ball is caught. I thought for a second I might have gotten lucky, not going to lie. Finally, nice dark sky. It's going to be easier to see. Hopefully I'll pick up on it. And no. I was able to tell that I was down low for a ball, but I did not hold my swing. Need to be able to check that, Austin. Come on. And this is foul. Straight back. They just missed it. You know, when it goes straight back, that means a batter was almost on it. They literally just missed the pitch. And this is popped up. This is a nightmare. And I am out. Damn. Who's this? Oh, Mauricio Dubon. He's been here for a while. We don't see him much, though. All right, come on. We got defense. Maybe playing some defense will get me in the right attitude and turn things around. Maybe a comeback gets started. And here we go. Ball on the ground. Just get the easy out at second. The short way, good. Okay, now what do we have? We are batting still 4-0. to Tyler Glass now obviously still going to be out there. 101 pitches. My goodness. He is going the full length today, and that's a foul ball on a way too high fastball. It's at 166 games, folks, the hit streak. Can somebody please remind me what... My, oh, my God. I can't believe that. Okay, so 0-2 from that stupid fastball and a check swing on that dumb curveball. Here we go. And, whoa, way too high. Didn't even register on screen. Now, we got ourselves a 1-2 count. He's bound to throw one down the middle, right? Over 100 pitches. And this is going to be smoked for a hit. The hit streak continues. Man, I hate when it gets that late in the game. But what I wanted to ask you guys, can somebody please remind me what Mighty Goat's hit streak record is? Somebody commented on a road to the show that that's the next hit streak record I should chase. Mighty Goat's hit streak record. I think it was 176. I think, but I would appreciate it if somebody could please remind me so we all know for sure, because I think that's what it was, and if it is, we're approaching, we're getting close, and David Fletcher, 0-2, is going to defend right there, and it's going to be knocked down, I'm going to make it, Fletch did not make it, that is three outs, Glass now works out of it, no problem, 6-0, you got to be kidding me, dude. Okay, well, I might be able to get us one. Maybe. We'll see. And ball outside. Don't want it. Sinker tailing away. All right. If we can come back here in the bottom of the ninth, that would be one of the greatest comebacks. Like the Mariners. Remember that comeback for the wild card round? I'm sure y'all do. It just happened. That is what I need to channel. That's the energy I need right now. We need that comeback energy late in the game with runners on first and third. And this is going to hopefully bloop. It does. And he's going three. I too made too late of a decision. I should have gone to two, but whatever. It's fine. Got the run in. We're not going to be shut out. David Fletcher on a 1-2 count. I'm feeling nervous for you, my guy. Max Kepler playing first base for the Rays. Strange. Interesting. That ball would have hit me in the head if... This game, you know, wasn't a video game. All right, uh, I'm going to take that lead again, and I'll be able to tell if you're going to pick me off. Here we go. I'm going for a stolen base, and oh, it's popped up. Nice. Oh, he caught up to it. This is going to be a double play to end the game. Oh, whoa. No, he tagged up. You saved me from getting doubled up. Oh, my God. 
They could have just thrown it to first and had me to end the game. Wow, we got very lucky right there because that was right there in their face, and they ignored it. Here's the pitch. Here's Trout, and it's hit. It's lined, and that is game. Damn, dude. Uh, we had a little bit of a suspenseful ninth inning. We are going to have to take this L, play the next game, and turn it into a W. Almost positive we're going to be starting with a little day. Oh, is this a day game? Oh, I mean, it's fine when it starts in the evening and it gets darker as the game goes on. But it's tough when it's a day game because then I got to deal with that bright blue sky the entire game. The Rays are already up 2-0. to zero. And Frankie Montas on the Rays. I think we knew that already. Here we go. And whoa, no. Didn't even register on screen. Come on, buddy. Let's bring that down a little bit. You know, right in my wheelhouse. That's where I want it right here. Right there. And this is going to be up the middle. There we go. Two out single. Already getting the hit streak taken care of. That's what I like. And Max Kepler, I guess the full-time first baseman for the Rays. Interesting that they did not find a better decision. Does he play first base for the Rays and or sorry the Twins in real life? Uh, please, if anybody knows, let me know. And oh my God, Jared Walsh ain't gonna beat that out. He's too slow. Damn. Okay. Let's see what we got coming up next. We got some defense, and they of course add to their lead. Oh no, dude. Come on. Here we go. And this ball. Wow. Wow, dude. Of course goes foul damn okay let's see if we can produce that same swing and keep it in the field of play and this is late damn and too high don't swing at that austin i know i love the good fastball but I, that is not the pitch i want that is not the pitch we need and a foul ball on a slider almost hit me in the shin so we should probably be laying those off Frankie Montas, I'm just counting on you to give me a high fastball eventually. And that's off the end of my bat, and I'm surprised it actually sent him back. And look at this place, bro. To fill this stadium with this many fans for a day game? That's how you know we're good right now. I hope to see Angel Stadium like this in the near future. It is 4-1. to one. We need to make a comeback for this crowd. Brett Phillips lays down the perfect bunt. I'm not going to get him. Even though I reacted quick right there. I didn't even have to take my time to get that target. He's just that fast. And they added another one. Why, dude? Come on. I'm trying to mount a comeback here. And Wander Franco, I just realized, is the batter. And he gets it. Why? That's been happening so much lately. Making me watch a hit go right by me. And the guy never goes three. Ever. I swear, we never have a play at third. What's up now? Down five. It is 6-1. No outs. First and third. This is a big spot that could start the engine for a comeback. And this is going to ramp up the middle. Thank you, Mr. Mound. That is probably the only reason that thing got through. We literally launched off the mound. And now we have Jared Walsh, first and second. Don't be a rally killer, dude. Please do not be a rally killer. Can't steal either because he's got two strikes. And yep, I could have prevented that. But with two strikes, what if he struck out? Then we're all screwed. Okay, man. Let's see if we get anything. And oh my god. Of course. They get more runs and I come up with the bases loaded. It's like they just keep giving themselves enough to make it uh, not good enough for me. Yes. I'm a up the middle hit kind of guy today, and that will make it 8-5. He went three. I didn't even notice you did that, pal. Nice. Okay, so now down by three. If Jared gets a hold of one, we have a tie game. Let's pull the Mariners right now. It's comeback season. Chris Bassett also pitching not on the team he's on in real life, and that will be the third out. Damn it. Huh. This looks like comeback season's going to have to wait. And no, hold on. Hit a grand salami. Hit a... Oh, my God. Oh, we only need two. We only need two. What do you throw? Fastball, slider, sinker. Here we go. And ball outside. Okay. Base is loaded. This could be big. This could be amazing. This will get the stadium roaring. They probably already are. All this hype, all of this pressure on me. And no, 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 no. That's not even going to be a sack fly, is it? And no, it's not. Oh, my God. That's the one time I don't get a hit today. 
Oh, well, hopefully they also... No! The job... We didn't We didn't get one run out of that inning. We gotta stop taking L's like this. If you made it to the end of this video, I want you to comment. You have to be the big moment. Like the video, subscribe, tell your mom, your dad, your grandma, your grandpa, your pet friends, your really sister, and your uncle, everybody you know to subscribe to them already. I got this, you got this, we all got this, and I will see you next time.